out our uh, sunset forecast. The sun will set a little bit later each night as we make our way towards spring and just what we're at the end of January. So February actually begins this week, which means that just puts us about six weeks away. Great colors really abound for most of the state. It looks like a little bit better in Phoenix. Live look outside in HD from our News 4 Tucson HD Skynet camera does depict those beautiful sunny skies. Sky is blue. Temperatures, you know, cool, mild. Depends on you, uh, your tolerance, but mid 60s this time of year, not bad. 23 is the dew point. Winds are calm today. 20% your relative humidity. Temperatures mostly into the mid 60s, really not deviating anywhere from 64 to 66 here across the city of Tucson as you make your way into Cochise and Santa Cruz County. Still not a lot of variety. 60 in Pierce, Wilcox at 60, 62 in Bisbee, and 66 last check in Nogales. Here's that, that's how things shake out for the remainder of the evening. Still in the mid-60s by 5 o'clock. Remember that sunset time, about 5.53 or so. So by 6, 7 o'clock, we get our most rapid cooling, cooling about 9 degrees from 5 to 7. And then we get into the 40s really as soon as about 9 o'clock tonight, mid-40s by 11 o'clock or so. Sky is clear on live. Doppler, we do have a first piece of that disturbance starting to enter the Great Basin, places like Las Vegas right now and you can see most of that action is still up here in the Pacific Northwest. We do expect this area of low pressure to kind of skirt down this way, probably staying a little bit to our east and also the difference is this low pressure didn't originate over the ocean so it's a very dry storm system. Dry storm systems just mean we don't have a lot of uh, water to work with, and you'll see that in the forecast, so that's why our rain chances aren't that good. Then high pressure will be building up uh, off the coast of California to give us uh, warm conditions by this weekend. Here's Futurecast. 8 a.m. tomorrow morning, still mostly in the dry zone. There's some snow showers. Uh, 7 o'clock tomorrow night, they got a sprinkle of green right here, maybe a couple in Cochise County. That's why about a 10% chance of showers late on Wednesday and into Thursday, but again, not talking about very heavy amounts of rain. Probably no rain in Tucson, actually, but uh, even east of us, it looks like amounts will be very light because the system really originated over land. You just don't have a lot of water over land. That's why we called it land, right? Had this originated over the ocean, yeah, you would have seen more moisture. Kind of obvious, right? High pressure builds in this weekend for a very nice uh, treat Saturday and Sunday, looking at temperatures in the 70s. Potentially a sizable pattern change next work week as low pressure digs into the southwest once again, bringing some cooler air and maybe some wet weather. Still a few days to fine tune that forecast. Upper 30s for lows tonight, 10% chance of showers tomorrow with daytime highs into the 60s. 10% chance of showers also in Cochise and Santa Cruz County. Daytime highs, 50s and 60s. 66 tomorrow, cool on Thursday behind that system. 63, 67 Friday. There's your 70s on Saturday and Sunday. And there's potentially a pattern change Monday and Tuesday. Upper 60s Monday and just 60, 20% chance of rain on Tuesday, Priscilla. So... Looks like we got a little bit of everything in the forecast. Some cool conditions, some very warm conditions for the Super Bowl, and maybe a big pattern change as soon as early next work week. I know you're definitely going to want to stay outside for the Super Bowl with these nice temperatures. 70s, yeah. Can't beat that. Uh, can't beat that. Thanks, Matt. Sure. We'll still have.